this video about again about super centenarians I, I hope we can learn something from people who lived very long and today's uh, is story about Li Qin Yuan, Yuan, Yuan. Uh, he, uh, he died uh, in 1933. Super centenarians are those who uh, have reached the age of over 110 years. Only uh, about one in, uh, in 500 of the centenarians, that is people who lived longer than 100 years, were, uh, were set, uh, was getting to become a super centenarian. And only about 1,500 uh, super centenarians uh, have been registered in our history. According to researchers, uh, there should be between 300 and 450 li living super, uh, super centenarians in the world. Super centenarians are distinguished uh, by uh, in, in viable uh, health even in comparison with other centenarians. They inhibit even greater resistance to, gre to age-related uh, de degenerative diseases than centenarians. Therefore, they have an extreme compression of morbidity. Uh, it especially a uh, long health span followed by a rapid decline into death. Indeed, about 10% uh, percent of supercentenarians lived uh, to the last three months of their life without serious chronic diseases, compared with 4% uh, of semi-centenarians who lived longer than 105 years and only 3% of the centenarians. So today's story about Li, Jin, Li Qin Yuan, 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 Yuan. Uh, he was a Chinese herbalist healer and a martial artist and military tactic advisor. Along with his special diet uh, that included various kinds of herbs, uh, he firmly uh, followed meditation, physical activity and practiced uh, martial and uh, arts uh, throughout his life. He attributed his longevity to peace of mind and believed that anybody can live at least 100 years by attaining inward calmness and wisdom and self-control. In addition to collecting and preparing uh, potions uh, from herbs and mushrooms, he also regularly consumed medical tinctures with rice uh, vodka, rice uh, whiskey. Li Qing Yuan uh, is believed to, to have left over 200 of his descendants during his life, uh, surviving 23 wives. Other sources attribute 180 descendants to him from more than uh, 11 generations who lived at the time of his death at, at the age of 197. By the age of 13, 13 uh, being a boy, he began uh, collecting herbs in mountains with three elders. At the age of 51, he served as advisor in, mil uh, in military tactics, martial arts and topography uh, to the general uh, Yu Jung, Jung Kui uh, army. At uh, 78 uh, years old, he abandoned his military career uh, uh, after the Battle of Golden River and returned to collecting uh, medical herbs in Xin, uh, in Xin, Xinhua, Xin Chuan, Xin Chuan province. Till the end of his life, he was collecting and selling medical uh, herbs and uh, plants and mushrooms, such uh, like uh, yeah, go, go, goji berry, vinjinsin, goto cola, and <coughs> and mushrooms. Here I, I give you the recipe of the, this rice uh, vodka uh, tincture. So it's quite quite strange uh, composition. Uh, you have to keep it one, one year. And uh, some uh, ingredients like uh, dried uh, lizards, dried sea horses, and uh, yeah, it's, you can read it. So it is even uh, human placenta is used in the, in the tincture. One of, uh, of Li Qing Yuan uh, disciples, disciples uh, the Ta Jua Quan Master Da Lu, da li, lu Liu, Liu uh, told the story of his teacher. Already 130 years old, Master Li met in the mountains a hermit over 500 years old who taught him technique of the physical exercises. Uh, named Ba Kua Zhang and, uh, uh, and si, uh, si Gun, si Gun in combination with special breathing practices. 
the movements in these physical exercises should be coordinated with the specific sounds and holding the breath as well as following a special diet. Uh, da Liu, Liu reports that his teacher told him uh, that his longevity is due to the fact that he was practicing these exercises every day regularly, correctly and persistently for the rest of his life. He taught that for longevity it is necessary to achieve inner self-control, calmness and peace of mind. This is the Bagu Chan uh, uh, technique. So uh, in Bangkok you can see in uh, at morning uh, many Chinese uh, old elders uh, practice this uh, exercise, practice this technique, and also Tsigun. Tsigun also uh, it is more for women, but uh, nevertheless it is also very popular uh, in uh, countries where have Chinese population. Such at morning they are doing such uh, such physical exercises. Li Ching Yuan, Yuan uh, believed that state of mind uh, plays a, a large role in both quality of life and in longevity. Therefore, he meditated for long every day, getting up at dawn and ending the, the day at sunset, while uh, during the day he performed special exercises with a special breathing technique. While <coughs> we cannot be sure of Li Ching uh, Yuan exact uh, lifespan, there is still no doubt that he lived much longer than his uh, co contemporaries. Unfortunately, there is no exact information about his diet, how many times a day he ate, and what proportion of his diet were proteins and fats of animal origin. We can only speculate that he drank tea because it is in China it is absolutely possible, uh, absolutely uh, common and uh, no one uh, eat uh, without drinking tea. And uh, also he consumed spicy foods that are so common in the Sichuan province. The, uh, and while being in, in the mountain area uh, where edible parts, uh, plants are difficult to find, he maybe consumed some meat of rodents, snakes, lizards, and possibly uh, larva, insect, uh, and ants, uh, which is also very common in Thailand. So let's go through the, his uh, uh, herbs and uh, medical plants, in particular goji berries or wolf berries. Goji berries contain <coughs> pardon, betaine, steroid saponins, flavonoids, and uh, vitamins, and it is uh, very good uh, adapt again to increase physical uh, endur endurance and uh, to lessen uh, symptoms of uh, tiredness. Okay, ginseng. Ginseng is the root of plants of genius Panax. And again, uh, it is uh, considered that, uh, good for health. And you can buy it in, in, in here, in, in China, and uh, Southeast Asian countries. Astragalus contains flavonoids, and also it is very popular. It is used to, 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 in Chinese medicine and Chinese uh, kitchen, so they, they, use, they use it and it's easy to buy. Go to call or Centeva Asiatica, it is uh, the, uh, such simple plant. It is used as, as in salads and uh, eating, uh, people eat it with rice. Uh, it is, uh, so it is very, very popular in here. It is anti-inflammatory and it uh, should uh, reduce blood sugar yeah, during the diabetes. Uh, this uh, linji, linji or linji, uh, also as reishi mushroom, mushrooms very very popular at shops uh, with, uh, that are selling Chinese medicine, uh, dried so they uh, people consume it as um, uh, some in soup or as uh, a part of tinctures. Uh, polyg uh, polygonum uh, multiflorum. Uh, this is a uh, uh, very popular also medicine uh, and especially it is used in some, some shampoo and uh, it's, it is a remedy for seeming, seeming hair, hair loss and hair, and hair loss and alopecia. Okay, so when, when you're losing uh, hairs, uh, people use it uh, to get uh, natural color again. So this is, uh, yeah, also popular. And of course, it is tea. Tea, it is Chinese, uh, Chinese camellia. Uh, the tea shrub was uh, first cultivated in China. It's very, very popular if you go to China or Singapore or Hong Kong. 
nobody eat without tea not drinking tea it is absolutely an uh, uh, ingredient for every every day uh, life so so okay it has a lot of uh, alkaloids and uh, flavonoids so it is very very useful for health black people also are very popular everywhere it is uh, in, in Thailand also uh, popular and uh, it contains uh, flavonoids and alkaloids so it is very good for health and as we can see from the life story of Li Chin Guen uh, daily physical activity of low intensity it is walking exercises with stretching for flexibility and speed of reaction breath, uh, breath holding uh, hours of meditation for calmness uh, of mind and self-control have been combined uh, with herbs containing active uh, active bio substances alkaloids and flavonoids in the form of tinctures tea spices and dietary supplements i think that it is the combination of meditation physical activity diet and dietary supplements gave him an opportunity to live such a long life the history of the life of another uh, super centenarian and uh, what i was miss mrs uh, jean uh, kalman John, uh, John Kalman, uh, which I already told in uh, my old video, uh, confirms uh, this hypothesis. Indeed, before the age of 110, Mrs. Uh, Kalman uh, led uh, active life, lifestyle, buying and cooking own food, uh, riding a bicycle, attending a church services on everyday basis, and probably chocolate was a source of bioactive substances. In particular, uh, epicacatin and cahitin, uh, these are, uh, pardon, uh, uh, alkaloids, but uh, they are very good for health. And uh, so, but then in uh, age of 110, people convinced her to move to the, uh, to the Newson house, where she uh, was very limited in physical activity, and so she died, uh, passed away in 12, in 12 years, so don't do it. Uh, always try to to be active uh, there was a period in my life when i was keeping high hopes for traditional chinese medicine and hence spent a considerable amount of money on visits to chinese herbalists as well as or as well as on their herbs to cure my thai wife's infertility actually the, Ch the chinese healers were only selling packs of the herbs and mushrooms with no recommendations for the diet meditation or lifestyle at first, there was some not noticeable improvement in the condition of my wife's appearance and the particular skin, but later on the effect, the effect disappeared. Not to mention that the goal of her treatment was not achieved. I also do not see any exceptional longevity and good health among the healers who sell traditional Chinese medicine and those uh, wealthy pe people in Thailand who use the recipe, recipes uh, of the tradition of Chinese medicine. Obviously, it is uh, impossible to achieve rejuvenation and significant uh, health improvement with only herbs and medicines. Recently, it was demonstrated that physical activity in older age may reduce number of senescent or zombie cells in the body. But the optimal conditions and intensity of physical activity have not been established uh, by official medi uh, med medical care. For what I learned so far, I can speculate that high intensity interval training uh, with sufficient time to, for recovery uh, between, uh, between the exercises are particularly helpful. It is during the high intensity interval training our body quickly burns uh, carbohydrates uh, and gluten and goes into autophagy phase uh, when uh, protein biosynthesis gets interrupted. We can also assume that some biologically active substances like synostatics additionally suppress the biosynthesis of signal uh, and signaling uh, proteins at the CA is uh, S ASP, a senescent associated secretive phenotype in the senescent cells or toxins. And uh, therefore, uh, they reduce the rate of uh, accumulation of the zombie cells or the senescent cells. And eventually, the immune system may efficiently uh, kill uh, senescent cells at the rate higher than uh, they multiply. And this, uh, with this technique, we, we can uh, achieve some rejuvenation of our bodies because number of senescent cells 
uh, will re be reduced. Uh, for me personally, an improvement in appearance and health have been achieved only by a combination of vitamins and supplements following the flexible carnivore diet, intermittent fasting, and practicing f physical activity, in particular swimming and cycling. Moreover, it, if possible, at least twice a day, I try to go to into high-intensity interval training for about 10-15 minutes by sporting uh, to maximum speed with my bicycle. Uh, uh, however, endurance exercises uh, are also beneficial since my mind calms down and the nervous system practically goes into a meditation mode. Swimming uh, works especially well as it improves my sleep at night. And if everything is arranged uh, well, I may detect a considerable improvement in endurance and muscle strength as well as better mental productivity. I don't stress myself during the exercises. In, uh, actually, instead, I enjoy the feeling to be strong and creative. So over time, I expect to ex extend the longevity and improve my life uh, even more. Uh, for the, from the analysis of the life uh, of super uh, centenarians in scientific publications, I made, <coughs> pardon, I made the following conclusion for myself that it is impossible to se select a particular efficient synostatic substance among thousands and thousands of biologically active flavonoids, alkaloids, and polyphenols. Instead, we may find for ourselves the most optimal way of obtaining such synostatics in necessary amounts. Also, uh, some popular flavonoids are already available as dietary supplements. I believe it is better to get them from food. For example, we may consume more than 100 grams of dark chocolate every day, drink tea and probably coffee, uh, use various kinds of paper, pepper, uh, onion, garlic, parsley, and other spicy helps in hot uh, seasoning, seasonings and sauces, and drink a small amount of medical tinctures at night. Biologically available uh, uh, availability of the flavonoids is low, and we may think on how to improve the digestibility of the substances. And as for, uh, as for the tincture, you can uh, uh, turn to the recipes uh, of Chinese herbalists or develop your own uh, recipe for potion. <clears throat> this is what I do, for example, I make the potion myself and drink it uh, about 50 milligram uh, at night. It's not that I, I want to drink, but I, I take some twice uh, 25 gram and then rest a little bit and uh, drink again. Below you can read uh, annotations of some scientific publications that I se have selected for this presentation. At the same time, it is necessary to remember that uh, neither uh, my personal opinion nor uh, any scientific publication can be used as a medical advice. Any person, him or herself, are responsible for own health and can decide on what to do or to follow the advice of a personal physician. However, since uh, there are not uh, there, there are not yet reliable, reliable clinical trials that demonstrate significant reliable rejuvenation. Nobody can rely on official allopathic healthcare. Moreover, the genetics uh, in all people are different. What is suitable for someone may be not working for other people. So it is necessary to be flexible and listen to reaction of your own body. I believe that personal rejuvenation and significant extension of uh, productive, uh, healthy and productive life is a significant goal to stay focused and work on, uh, on it. <coughs> Better health is fair enough reward for your efforts. As you may see, my rejuvenation program that does not include expensive medications and technique. What I propose is to follow the optimal diet. It is for me, it is carnivore diet. Eat only during a relatively short time interval. For example, uh, keep fasting from 16 to 20 hours a day, even maybe 22 hours a day. And physical activity in the periods of fasting with uh, the main focus on high intensity interval training because it takes not so long, maybe half hour a day, not, not longer. And also meditations that include cardio and endurance physical exercises, for example, because swimming and walking and cycling. 
So this again, your mind uh, will calm down if you're just walking or, 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 or especially swimming. <clears throat> and also, if possible, shifting your schedule to wake up at dawn, uh, at morning, and uh, to uh, go sleep to not too late at evening. So that the sleep duration will be at least about eight hours. A flexible carnivore diet can be inexpensive and uh, dietary supplement can be obtained mostly from tea, cocoa powder, and spices. Dry yeast and animal fat are good sources of vitamins, but also you can uh, get uh, supplements. Uh, this, uh, so there remain uh, only some inexpensive uh, medicine like metformin, berberine, DHEA, 5-HTP, and antihistamines. Again, it is so uh, affordable to do. Here, in short words, uh, my rejuvenation program. The key word is flexibility. I learned and changing. Uh, I am learning and changing my lifestyle in accordance with the level of my knowledge. So it is not a fixed uh, program. I am learning. For example, I am changing from twice uh, eating twice a day to eating once a day. It's again I'm more. Uh, listening, I'm listening to my body and uh, do what, what is the best for me. But produ producing videos on the subject is my additional motivation. Of course, it would be nice to have additional uh, tools for measuring uh, biological age in order to judge rejuvenation not only by measurements of endurance, but uh, my blood tests and methylation rate. I hope in time to uh, acquire my own laboratory to conduct experiments at least on nematode worms and yeast. If rejuvenation protocols and technique will be in demand, uh, the necessary funds for research can be obtained from clients and investors. And as I said, I am very optimistic about future. Research in this area and number of publications grows at high speed, maybe in five <coughs> or eight years rejuvenation will be a technology, yet I prepare to be uh, uh, at the frontier of this science. Pardon. If you were patient enough to get to this, uh, to this slide, I wish you the best uh, health and uh, great, uh, best luck in your life. Have a wonderful day. This, again, this, you can download the presentation and uh, go through these publications about uh, the usefulness of uh, uh, of synalytics and uh, different uh, flavonoids, what, what you can get from food. And it is yeah, very interesting, very interesting, uh, I think, uh, information. Okay, and then that's what I say. I'm not medical, I'm not giving medical advice. And, uh, please don't, don't consider any of these publications as medical advice, and, but it is some knowledge. If you know what they're doing, you can achieve this uh, longevity you can achieve a huge improvement of, my, of your health. And myself, I, I, I got it, I got it uh, just recently. I, I, I can uh, measure my endurance and I can see that at least 10, maybe 20% better uh, endurance. I can go at higher speed and longer time uh, with my bicycle and I feel great. And uh, so this, is, this gives results. So if it is, it is enough for me, again, I enjoy life. And in time, I wish only enjoy it but more. And this is this um, motivation for me is good enough to to stay focused on on this uh, rejuvenation program. So again, <clears throat> thank you for your attention. Have a wonderful day. <clears throat>